I am walking the entire length of Caraba Avenue. And right now I'm in Westfield. It's gonna take me about 40 minutes to walk from Westfield to the traffic light in Caraba Avenue. Uh, I mean around back out. So let's um, walk around and see what's available around this place. We did this video about one or two years ago and I'm gonna do an update. I am sure most of you who are joining the channel recently that haven't seen this video yet. And even if you've seen the other one, I'm sure in a guy there every few months there are always updates. Updates and upgrades everywhere you go. So as you can see, this is a new building that is coming up here in Westfield. The last time we did the video, none of this building were started. Yeah, at least the trust bank was here. And this is also another new building that came up really fast here in Westfield. And uh, I'm gonna, going, going straight this way will take you to Banyul. I'm gonna take a, right, a left turn, which is the Calabar Avenue right here. And behind me, this is the way to, uh, towards Tabo Koto, Latikuna, Bekama. So let's take a quick left turn and walk straight. So I'm gonna break this video into about three because I wanna keep it very, very long. I know some of you might want a very long video, but most of our followers would not have time to go through long videos. So I would find time to do a very, very long video for some of you who always want to have very long videos. But in this case, right now, the video that I'm doing, I'm gonna be breaking it into three, maybe, uh, I'm gonna walk for a while, maybe like 10 minutes. I'm gonna cut this video and do part two, part three, and part four so that you don't have to sit and watch the entire length of the video. So just watch part one. Anytime you have the time to come back and watch part two, then you can do the same for part three. All right, and if you want long videos, let me know also in the comments. We'll try to get you that as well. So I'm gonna try to move to the right side. Yeah, that's the main roundabout of Westfield. The main one about our Westfield, okay. Actually, I have to move to the left side, yeah, because as you can see, uh, there are no footpaths right here, okay. In most of the uh, routes in Caravan, you know, footpaths are available unless if you walk outside of the route, maybe on the sides, yeah. And actually, that's what I'm supposed to be using, okay. So, um, yeah, I have to wait for the traffic and yeah, cross safely. And that is the Gamtel house over here. Okay, and along the Caraba Avenue, you, you would see that it is only businesses that are available here on a highway. So I'll try to show you most of the businesses as well, what they sell, you know, where they are located. If I can find their phone numbers also on the shops, yeah, I might also show you that. But I'm not going to be walking into the shops. Maybe we can do that in another video. In fact, there was a video that we did in Westfield here where we walked into a few of the shops. You can see this one. Uh, uh, money bureaus. This one is uh, electronic shop uh, HM and right after it you have the standard chartered right here Standard chartered is available here and over there you have Solstar. This is owned by a Gambian doing uh, electronics, you know um, Yeah, selling electronic stuff like refrigerators ACs house lights, you know a lot of different different electronics material that are available in most of these uh, big big shops and we did a video uh, for them about maybe a year ago maybe a few months ago six seven months ago maybe eight months ago in the Abrikama branch so if you want to check that video just um, search for price of uh, electronics in the Gambia maybe you can add salt to it but I'm not sure we put the name salt and this is Prima right here we also did another video on Prima these people also deal with uh, solar materials, lights, electronics, and the like. So I might do another update video for them. So another time. Okay, let's move, keep moving. Let's move straight. And these are exchange bureaus. So there are local people that do uh, money changes also around this area. And you have city furniture right here. They deal with furniture, luxurious furniture. And you have a taxi garage right here. Am I right? And as you can see, most of the places here is for businesses. You have central send traces over there, and you also have MP trading on my left side on here. They are one of the oldest Indians doing electronic business here in the Gambia. Several years. Yeah, several years. Can see all these places are with electronics and electrical shops 
And that's a gift shop right here. Gift shop where they sell a lot of materials or stuff that you can give out as a gift. And you have this people here specialized on nets, booting materials, glues, you know, anything that you would need to do your fishing right here in the game. I'm gonna zoom in right there. So that's their telephone number. Hopefully uh, some of them will, will be on WhatsApp and all of these other ones except the money transfer bill are uh, uh, electronics and electrical stuff. The last one mainly do solar, yeah? Mainly do solar, that's HM Enterprise. And that says the junction, another junction that goes straight into Saracunda. Yeah, it goes straight into Saracunda. All right, and you have unique solution over here. They mainly focus, they used to focus on I, uh, internet service providing. Okay, as you can see, they're tower over there, but now they've now also get into solar, you know, supplying of solar materials, solar products over there. So, yeah. And you also have another home city. They deal with our uh, home decoration stuff, lightning and, you know, yeah, lightning most of the time and any decoration stuff. And you also have lasting solution over there. Lasting Solution is a school, an ICT uh, school or school that is uh, specialized in ICT, uh, teaching of ICT courses and also providing ICT solutions. This is where I do most of my course and I, also, I was also there as a part-time lecturer teaching uh, some networking courses. Yeah, but now I have stopped all part-time work doing this YouTube and my full-time job doing gardening as well but it's one nice making a lot of students you know going around to try to teach a lot of students on these IT techniques or technologies all right go along you have a, a, a LG over there yeah LG over there and we also did a video on these shops where they are, are pulling out some stuff from the shop yeah they also um, deal with solar material yeah, if you charge nice Gambia solar price of solar, yeah, price of solar materials or price of price of solar appliances, you should be able to see that video. Yeah, and you also have some uh, car decoration center over here. About three or four shops that sell some car decoration, car you know. Uh, yeah, most of the uh, products are on cars. So you have some fruits, fruit sellers. Yeah. Some uh, yeah, these are watermelons. Yes, watermelons. And we are in the watermelon season. Uh, for the next one or two months, we'll be straight into this uh, um, watermelon season. You can see some other buildings coming up right there. Some other buildings coming up right there. So we are about maybe twenty percent into the kind of video. Maybe in fact ten percent. We've not gone anywhere yet, so probably this videos can be a little bit more. Maybe I might pick it into four because I don't want to get it really, really long. So maybe every 10 minutes it will be. I'll have to cut it and do another one. All right, yeah, I'll put the station and opposite it, you have the Alliance Franco, the old time school. Long, long time ago, they've been here and still here. They deal with uh, or they teach you French. And in the game you can have some uh, watermelons that are cut into pieces. If you want to just have a quick, you know, bite on the watermelon, just buy it for maybe ten dollars, fifteen dollars, yeah. And a big, big, the full, the whole watermelon itself can be uh, maybe around hundred dollars. You might have fifty when the market is saturated. And right there you can see this the road that I used to give you an update on. I did that update about a week ago, so I will have to wait another week. Uh, I can see they have already poured some water on it and there are some heavy vehicles around it. Hopefully they will start doing some work. Or they, in fact they've been doing the work all, all along. So I mean maybe they will have uh, a major development before I come about. And more and more electronic shops. A light and some other fishing materials. You can see some fishing or engine boat or boat engines over there. 
I will do a video here showing you these luxurious cars some time ago. Yeah, right here. We did a video on the cars that they sell. You can check out that by typing price of used cars in the Gambia or price of luxury used cars in the Gambia, something like that. And this is also another big building coming up. And there's two or three more ahead right there. Lots of big, big buildings are coming up here in the Gambia. And that is working together shoes. We did a video with them some time ago on our TikTok and YouTube page. So you can also check them. They have very reasonable prices, you know, shoe prices for both male and female. All right, so that's why we did our false giveaways. And that's their telephone number right on this board. So I'm gonna keep walking straight. And yeah, so they're just opening. But anyways, Let's keep moving. And that's Mori Balong on my left side right there. Mori Balong. They deal with furnitures. Yeah, furnitures. Especially luxury furnitures. And you can see their number right there on the board. We did a video on them as well. So those just those are site for luxury furnitures here in the Gambia. And opposite, almost opposite you have skincare products. We will do some few videos on the owner of this uh skincare product yeah into some other businesses as well and right there too you have stop step pharmacy stop steps is also one of the most recognized pharmacy here in the Gambia. i think they are now a healthcare providers not just pharmacy and up straight you have kill cell you have Rasland. Uh, these people deal with uh, furnitures, you know, TVs, you know, a lot of household material. And on the left side, you have the LK School. Yeah, the LK School is right here. And right now, we are kind of like we are in Carnifing, I guess. I guess we are in Carnifing. Yeah, we should be around in Carnifing right now. So as you can see through the glasses, you have TVs, big base TVs, smart TVs, you know, furnitures, and there's a new shop also on the left coming up, a new one, not yet sure which one <coughs> or what they will be selling, but probably it might be furnitures because this site, a lot of furnitures and electronic shops is what available or what is available around here. Alright, so this used to be GAM Electronics or uh, Gambia Electrical. It's still Gambia Electrical. So if you want your quality electrical products, this is one of the most recommended places to come and get your stuff, get your products. Next you have VIP shop or maybe Easy Financial and next to it you have VIP shop. They're not yet open but they have nice fashion you know office wares right there that yellow or is it yeah around, i think yellow door and after the junction you have are you furnitures they also sell furnitures yeah big big time furnitures luxury furniture hundreds of thousands hundred thousand dollars two hundred thousand dollars two hundred fifty thousand dollars in furnitures is available here just like what we were seeing in um uh, Fatima's trading which is a little bit ahead all right so um this is Q cell we have Q cell here the Gambia's GSM operator one of the GSM operators in the Gambia and this is owned by a Gambia <laughs> and right opposite it is where you have the junction that takes you to Manja yeah so this will be a fourth junction on the Caraba Avenue or along the Caraba Avenue that will take you straight in Kumanja. All right, so this is a good place to end this video right now. It's almost 14 minutes, so I'm gonna end this video. Don't forget to move on and watch part two if you're still having time to go ahead and watch more for our video. So I'm about to right behind the camera, and like I said, we are walking and showing you along all the entire land of the Caravan region. So see you in the next video, the part two of this video.